Hola, bienvenidos a los diarios de Gordon. Otra vez. Hola, bienvenidos a Lightspeed Spanish y Meet the Socios. And today we are with Pedro Kenworthy, the famous Pedro Kenworthy of, of our Facebook group. Hola, Pedro, ¿qué tal? Um, muy bien, gracias. Muy bien, ¿y tú? También, estoy muy bien. Uh, listen, um, we'll call you Pedro because I, I know you as Pedro now, not as Peter. Yeah? yeah. But, uh, Pedro, tell us a little bit about yourself. Where, where else do you live? I live in Shaw in Oldham. I live in Shaw in Oldham. I'm a, I'm a teaching assistant in a special needs school. I'm married, I've got two children. Uh, my daughter's 30, my, my son's 25, he's got autism. He's got, he's, he's quite a handful. He's, he's gone out at the moment swimming with my wife. Uh, I like music from the 80s. Um, I like going on holiday, I like walking, going, for, going to the gym, all that sort of stuff. So, um... So tell tell us, uh, Pedro, why are you learning Spanish? Because every year I go to Spain and I just think it's so rude sometimes for people not to try a little word or two. Uh-huh. And I've noticed uh-huh. now that with, with speaking a little bit of Spanish, when I go to Spain, you get a bit more um, interaction with the locals and with the the camareros and the, the, the staff. It's just a... a why not? You know, you're visiting their country, pay them a bit of respect. Absolutely, absolutely, yeah. And and so how do you think it's going for you, learning Spanish? Since Sir Socios, brilliant. Because I did, I did have classes, you know, with the authority and they were so rigid and boring. And I think I mentioned before on Facebook that we didn't even, conjug- we didn't even discuss verbs for the first 12 months. 12 months, <laughs> just learning how to order a beer and what a bocadillo was and... And, I, and and then the second year it was we did a couple of verbs and then they discussed about conjugation and I just thought what and I just felt I was going nowhere so I started to look on the internet and I think they just have to follow a curriculum like we do in schools. Mm-hmm. Um, I just it wasn't for me. It's no disrespect to the teaching staff there. It's just it wasn't for me. So I, I was very 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 disheartened. And then I, I looked on YouTube and I found some Spanish stuff. Sure. And yours just hit the bullet. Mm-hmm. There was something mm-hmm. about it that I really liked, obviously. Okay, yeah, absolutely. You're still here, yeah, yeah. So, how long have you been learning now? Pedro? Well, well, it goes back probably five or six years that I started. Yeah. And then I had a year off, and I just didn't want to go back. And then I, sure. I, I came very reluctant to learn. I mean, it's quite embarrassing, really, because. After five, six, seven years of learning Spanish, where my level is, but I feel that it's only in the last couple of years where I've really started to enjoy it. And think, yeah, I get that. Yeah. Why yeah. didn't you tell me that in the first place? Sure, it's, sure, yeah. I just feel they were lost years. Okay, well, you know, you know, it's not a race, and you've got the rest of your life, so don't yeah. worry about it. You know, don't worry about it. So listen, shall we? Shall we talk a little bit in Spanish? Sí, you know, absolutamente. Yeah. Este mañana. Estoy un poco, en este momento estoy un poco cansado porque me voy a ir, no, me voy a andar este mañana a las dos horas de por dos horas de medio. A las dos, a las dos, ¿te fuiste? A las dos. ¿De la mañana? No, 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 perdone, a las diez de... Joder, por eso estás cansado, ¿no? Uh, fui a andar por 10... Uh, no, no, no. Yeah, 10 miles. Ah, vale. Diez, Mile, diez. Miles. Uh-huh. So, estoy cansado. Uh, uh, un momento, por favor. Uh, uh, ¿Fuiste, ¿Fuiste con Bell o solo? No, no, no. Ah, ah, sí, con mi amigo con quien trabajo. Ah, sí, un uh, uh, school teacher, friend. friend. Sí, un, profe, un profesor. Profesor, no. sí. Pero, las año pasado, las año pasado, cuando fui a Benidorm, uh-huh. Uh-huh, mi, I pasé una semana en Benidorm este año. Eh, a mí me gustó mucho España. Eh, 
this gets really hard, you know, sometimes garden. <laughs> Don't worry about it. All right, I'm going to ask you some questions, okay? And I'll, I'll guide you a little bit. With, let's see. Eh, ¿Te gusta Benidorm? No? Sí, ¿Te gusta? me gusta mucho Benidorm. Es, eh, el... ¿Cuántas veces has estado en Benidorm ya? Uh, ¿Cuántas veces? Seis. Tres. Ajá. Ajá. Uh, ¿Y, ¿Y eres tú un hooligan o no? En Benidorm. Me? No, no, sí. no. Estoy <risa> típicamente español. A mí me gusta español. Uh, a no me gusta in, los ingles personas en Benidorm. No. No, no. no. Uh, el hotel, Hotel Corona del Mar, es una uh -huh. zona típicamente español. Ah, vale, sí. Sí, ah. sí una, una día, una día, uh, fui a comprar en el supermercado y compré un uh, jamón de belate ibérico. Sí. Ah, ibérico. Uh, mucho dinero, sí. ¿no? Pero me encanta. Eh, Volvo a mi hotel y pus, puse la carne en la mesa. ¿Entiendo? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. La, el camarero, el camarero mira uh -huh. a la jamón. Sí. Uh -huh. Y ¿Te gusta a él? No, no, no. Sí. So, uh, dice, dice a él. Uh -huh. Do you like this meat? In English. Uh -huh. I said, me encanta jamón ibérico de belote. Es pata negra. Es, es, es. Un momento. Eh? Un momento, se dice. Y dos minutos ayer. Y vol volver. Ay, con un uh, iPad. Con un iPad, sí. iPad. Mira, mira, este es el Ferro, uh, Ferro Pata Negra, with the black hooves. And he, he, uh, he was going on and on about Spanish food. Okay, And okay. then it was, fan it was fantastic. Spanish, Spanish people take, take, um, are very proud of the food. And if you show that you like it, they're mm -hmm. over the moon with that. They love it. Yeah. It's a big compliment to them. Feliz con porque tenemos una conversación en español un poco, pero sí. me, me, eh, me encanta. Muy bien, muy bien, muy bien, Pedro. Pues muy bien. Eh, yo sé que estudias mucho y yo sé que vas a tener un buen nivel de español, porque estudias, sí. ca estudias. Casi todos los días, ¿no? Cada día estudias algo. En este ¿verdad? momento, sí, estoy en vacaciones por seis semanas. Ajá. Uh -huh. eh, también estudio es, esos días por, sí, estos días, sí. eh, por uh -huh. uno o dos horas. Cada día, pues muy bien, lo haces muy bien y te, te deseo mucho, mucha suerte con tus estudios, Peter. Y... Muchísimas gracias por hacer la entrevista conmigo. Absolutamente. De nada. Vale, entonces, y nos vemos en Facebook, ¿no? Sí, sí, en Facebook. Vale. ¡Hasta luego! Hasta luego. Adiós. Y eso es todo. Gracias por haber estado conmigo y nos vemos en el próximo diario. ¡Hasta luego, chicos! ¡Hasta luego!